easy, easy. And that's for blowing my cover in Tehran, Clive. I can't believe I agreed to this. You simply need to get Sharif Kamoyo beats within two meters of the laptop for 60 seconds, Everett. We'll handle the rest. Right. Ah, hello. Clive Reston, MI6. I believe your techs have something that belongs to us? Right, this way. Thank you. The team's been working to crack the thumb drive overnight. Oh, good. Just about there. Come on. Here you go. Thanks, Miss Davidson. Please, call me Debbie. Oh, Debbie, thank you. The information on this thumb drive may well be key in finding Spymaster. Having Harmon Taylor loose on U.S. soil is bad for both our countries. But is it true that he has never been caught? Not yet. No, excuse me. So, what are you doing here, Sport? Uh, it's classified, sir. Your position is very good, Everett. Our team is interfacing. Oh, mm, in encryption on this looks a bit tasty. Do you think you'll manage to crack it? I'm sorry, why are you here? In so close? Well, just mildly curious, that's all. I want to see how it's done on this side of the pond. Mr. Reston. Just uh, I'm talking, what's your name? 30 seconds more. Uh, Steve. Steve, I'll give you two seconds, thank you. You should be going. The team has a lot on their plate. But straight up, mm. it'll probably take me a couple more days. And whoever designed this rig is... I, oh, I must sure. insist, Mr. Reston, this area is not typically for foreign agents. <clears throat> Apology. Steve, thank you. You move too soon. No need to be impatient. <sighs> right. No, I'm sorry. I must just ask, how do you all work with this noise going on in here? Surely your superiors can find a way to dampen the sound of the servers in here. It's not the servers. They still haven't fixed the toilet upstairs. We put in three facilities requests this week. The toilet upstairs. Good. Best of luck catching Spymaster. Honestly, it sounds a lot more exciting than what we're doing around here. Well, I'll be sure to let you know when we've apprehended him. Maybe we could um, go for dinner to celebrate, Debbie. I like that clip. The laptop remains a problem, Ross. Yeah, it's as good as done. Excuse me, where's your loot? The Kamoya beads will transmit through concrete, right? Of course. Uh -huh. Well, apologies for this. Did I just hear a toilet flush? Now the steel pipe should amplify the signal from the beads. Interfacing for a second time. There you go. It's finished, and the laptop itself well, now it's useless. I'll kick it back to the CIA. Should have it by tomorrow. Thank you, Everett. Well, you better retrieve the beads. I gotta go haul a British spy out of my trunk. And his daughter of the border. We must speak about the future of Wakanda. The other elders fight for the right to the throne, drawing straws to decide on who will get the honor of being assassinated by Namor next. And what is it you believe should be done? We must perform the ritual at Warrior Falls, as tradition dictates. And I want you to step forward on behalf of the border tribe. To become queen? No one has more support among the people than you, queen. Sanalam. Wakanda would be proud to stand behind you. And what of Shuri? 
cannot allow the whims of a grieving woman to sway the fate of our great nation. My advice would be to lay low as the drumbeat of war builds. Then, when the dust settles, you will become the leader this country truly deserves. You know you don't need to do that. Do what? Protect me. I'm not here to protect you. I'm here to say goodbye. Where will you go? Wherever my new spacesuit takes me. <laughs> I thought you said it was ugly. Oh, it's hideous. For a Dora. But I'm not a Dora anymore. Thank you. For everything. If you ever need me, na ni ni na. <laughs> <laughs> 